Yeah, so I flew from Quebec to Minnesota, picked up my truck, it was there from an earlier trip. Drove from Minnesota to Washington, stayed a night, got up the next day and drove straight to Whistler to meet up with Dustin Craven for some Whistler backcountry time. It was hard this year transitioning from urban riding to backcountry riding just because I didn't have enough time to ride park and warm up how I normally do. So it was a lot of ragdolls, a lot of anger. Backcountry, when it comes to hitting jumps for the first time, we always Rochambeau to see who's got to go first. So if you lose that Rochambeau, you're going first. And that first try is always so sketchy because you just don't know for sure how fast you need to go. That looked too slow. Wow. It felt fast, but at the same time, I could see how it could have been slow. And on this one particular jump that it was a little bit of a step over gap and the first time I ended up hitting this jump I was going through a cab five, a pretty basic trick where I could see the landing and I'd never have overshot a jump as bad as this jump in my life. I remember seeing the landing and rolling my arms down because I realized I was going to land in the flat and in mid-air there was enough time where I was like, okay, I need to let my board go up and land on my back so I don't blow my knees out. I remember right before I went into the snow, I thought to myself, I hope this is soft because if it wasn't, I was going home in a helicopter. And uh, luckily it was, you know, it's one of those moments where you got lucky. Sometimes when you build these jumps, you just hit it right the first try. You know, you can land your first trick, and second trick, and third trick, and then the very next jump, you just struggle. You can't, you overshoot it, you don't land anything, and this is almost one of those jumps. I, I did finally get a switch back one at the very end of the, at the, end of the session. The Whistler trip, the weather was good and the snow was good, but my riding wasn't where I was hoping it would be, so I left pretty frustrated. But it was, uh, it was good to see where I was at and, and get my bearings for the next trip moving forward. Yeah.